Yo, what's good everybody? Um, real quick, it's early in the morning for me. Um, I'm still on like Vegas time, but 2K dropped a whole bunch of news at like seven in the morning. Um, some type of leak happened. I don't know where it's from. I don't know if it was Europe, I don't know if it was China, but we did get a couple different instances of the leak of the all-star edition and stuff like that a couple days ago um i'm tired of reporting on stuff that are are leaks and stuff like that i kind of want to wait until stuff is generally out because i hate cell phone quality images scummy images uh stuff that looks like it was made in the back of the alley somewhere but we do have all of the information but what i wanted to talk to you guys about was the actual news release for nba 2k25 so not only will we be seeing first look screenshots cover athletes and the covers we're also going to dive into what 2k has in store for us coming in 2k25 so let's hop into it all right so like i told you guys july 10th which is today um i will I, I stayed up until like four in the morning um my cat had to be taken to the emergency room um yeah so you know y'all y'all um that was watching me on twitch last night i appreciate y'all for um thinking about zebo and shit putting them in y'all prayers but Ball over everything. NBA 2K25 features NBA champion Jason Tatum, two-time WMB MVP Aja Wilson, and Hall of Fame legend Vince Carter as cover athletes. Okay, NBA 2K25 debuts first NBA WNBA dual global cover, celebrating the growth of the popularity of basketball. Launches worldwide on September 6th, a day after my mother effing birthday. Bro, I'm trying to be on somebody island, <laughs> white sand, blue water, and y'all dropping this the day after my birthday? Come on, man. Um, With the new gen versions of NBA 2K25 delivering enhanced authenticity and realism powered by ProPlay technology on PlayStation 5, Xbox Series XS, and new for this year on PC? No, next gen came to PC? Hey, yo, all my, all my PC users, rejoice in the comment section. Go ahead, rejoice in the comment section. Yo, listen, a thug might be coming to PC this year. Hey, yo, Trey, I know you ain't got no power. Hey, I'm on PC this year, bro. We got to make some vids. Oh, my God. Next gen on PC? Oh, okay, okay, okay. Um, t Today, 2K unveiled that five-time NBA All-Star Boston Celtics ran the NBA champ. Jason Tatum will be on the cover. Um, Tatum will be featured alongside back-to-back -back WNBA champion, two-time WNBA, six-time WNBA All-Star. Uh, um, let me see. GameStop exclusive physical edition available in the U.S. and Canada. Um, the 2024 uh, Naismith Memorial Basketball Hall of Fame inductee, eight-time All-Star and two-time All-NBA team and NBA dunk contest legend Vince Carter will be featured on the cover of NBA 2K25 Hall of Fame Edition. NBA 2K25 will be available on September 6th. All right, so they just told me what the highlight stuff was again. Um, now, the game will be coming out on PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4, Xbox Series XS, Xbox One, PC, and Nintendo Switch again this year. Woo! Um, it is an honor to be named cover athlete for NBA 2K25. Jason Tatum said, I've been playing NBA 2K since I was a kid, and it's been a dream that one day to be on the cover. Even after coming off an NBA championship, it's humbling to see this come to life. Okay, being featured on NBA 2K25 cover is a big moment for me and a testament to ever-growing fandom of the WNBA, said Aja. Um, seeing more and more WNBA athletes scan into NBA 2K25 to best capture the style and confidence of the league has been empowering and i can't wait for the fans to experience it in game okay um between our honors nba 2k the uh, the neil smith uh basketball hall of fame have bestowed upon me this year is an unforgettable one making me pause with gratitude at my career said vince carter being named a cover athlete would have always been a special moment for me but it is particular honor to be on the cover of the nba 2k25 hall of fame edition now I'm not gonna lie, man. Um, giving Vince Carter his flowers is a W. I'm a I'm a huge Vince Carter fan, obviously. You know what I'm saying? It, it it goes with my last name. It goes to the number that I've been using since I was a kid for certain things. Like it's that this, this is huge for me. I ain't even gonna cat because already know I'm a, I'm you know what I'm saying I'm probably gonna get the physical joint, keep that, put that as a keepsake or something like that. Um, with NBA 2K25 and probably I ain't gonna lie. I don't know what what should I keep the disc? I don't know because all I really want is the case. Uh, uh, I'll think about that later. Um, maybe a giveaway coming. I don't know. Um, with NBA 2K25, players will forge a dynasty in my career. 
compete in the new my team modes and for those on new gen platforms players will also experience an added six era in my nba a more compact and interactive city along with the chance to cement their goat status in the w okay so goat status is coming to the w the city is going to be more compact now that might be a w not just a w um in addition the new updates in my career and my team players on current gym will experience an all new neighborhood metropolis to explore where they will compete um complete quests and earn rewards and eclipse their rivals okay um, the new gen version of NBA 2K25 is available on PlayStation 5 support powered by Enhanced Pro Play. Mm -hmm. New gen NBA 2K25 delivers a franchise most true to life basketball experience yet offering players the ultimate control in how they dominate the competition. Players on PC will, uh, with compatible specs, will now benefit from the enhanced realism of Pro Play. Okay, and the ability to compete. And most such as my NBA to W to City crossplay will only be available to consoles. They still not trusting y'all PC niggas. I'm just saying they 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 still can't trust y'all. This right here, that paragraph right here tells us that they still do not have an anti cheat system. They have not purchased one. They probably won't be getting one this year. So. PC, I'm sorry, y'all still gonna have to be balling by yourselves over there, even though y'all got the the next gen. Um, I can't lie to y'all. Um, if you don't understand why PC gaming is so important and this is a big step, it's because console players have to pay to play online every year. And some people do it monthly, some people do it in a package deal for the year. But now that PC gamers can now get the new the new gen game, they save sixty, eighty, a hundred dollars from you know every year having to pay for that so that's a w um in a year that showcases competition at the highest level and uh, in play style that is unique uniquely one's own one um, we're thrilled to share jason aja and vince on nba 2k25 cover said greg thomas president at visual concepts the development team has delivered another innovative experience for basketball lovers setting up nba 2k25 to be the next icon in this long-standing dynasty okay NBA 2K25 will offer four editions of the game in various digital and physical format standard GameStop exclusive WNBA edition um, that is available as a physical edition in the U.S. and Canada, All-Star edition and Hall of Fame edition um, is, that is only on sale through September 8th and includes a 12-month subscription to NBA League Pass. I'm not going to lie to y'all. Every time I've gotten the Hall of Fame edition and I've tried to put in that League Pass code, it's never worked for me. How many people and like, let me know in the comment section, how many of y'all have had that issue and how many of you all have actually used the lead code pass and it, I mean, the lead pass code and it actually worked for you. I want to, I want to know, I want to get a, a sense of like when, when it, when does it work and when does it not work? Let me know in the comments. Um, all editions are available for pre-order now worldwide on September 6th. Cool. Um, standard edition 70 WNBA edition 70, all-Star Edition 100, plus you get 100 KVC and my team content, including 10 my team player cards, three guaranteed to be 89 overall, three diamond shoe cards, three takeover boosts, one Amethyst Coach card, as well as my career content, including 150 skill boosts for 25 games, 75 Gatorade boosts, 25 games, Jason Tatum cover jersey, Jason Tatum electric skateboard skin, and 2K25 cover stars design t-shirt. Okay. Um, the limited availability Hall of Fame edition will be offered through um September for September 8th for $150. Um for PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4, uh, Xbox Series, uh SX1, PC. Hall of Fame edition includes everything in the All-Star Edition plus my career Vince Carter cover jersey. Uh, a season one pro pass with four upfront pro pass rewards and a 12 month NBA league subscription. So it's an extra $50. So you don't get more VC. You just get the league pass content, all of the content that the hundred dollar edition got. Uh, okay. Um, visit the uh, official website for a full breakdown of the SKU details. Cool. Um, developed by visual concepts. Cool. Um, follow 2k cool internet um connection and account minimum age varies cool um information about 2k okay um about take two okay and country okay cool all right so now that we know everything about the copies the release dates 
let's go ahead and check out some graphics. Um, mainly because when you come to the NBA 2K website, I'm not going to lie to you. The graphics that they have is not good. The, the cover art is amazing. You can see the cover art very good. But the in-game screenshots aren't that good on 2K's website. But I do have a fix for that. We I'm actually a part of um, the Discord over at 2K. And their images is 4K. So we're going to look at those right now. All right. So if you are a part of the Discord, then they do have a Discord that has like all the information that will be dropping. Like I told y'all, this stuff dropped at 7 o'clock this morning. No, I was not up. But when I did open up my phone, I did see a couple of uh, messages in the next makers uh, program and stuff like that. But let's go ahead and look at some stuff, man. So this is the cover art for NBA 2K25. I, I, I could open it in browser, but you guys can obviously see it. Um, This is the all star edition. This is a dual NBA and WNBA cover, which is a W for me. I'm not just punting it off the W. It's just simply that. We are now at a point where the NBA has been solidified for decades, right? And the WNBA has been waiting for its chance to break through. But a little bit of background on that that y'all may not know. The players union, the NBA players union that is, had a couple issues with things that were getting done. And the WNBA were always kind of like on their own. They wanted to get it out the mud. They wanted to do it on their own. They didn't want any handouts, right? But with the new contracts and stuff like that with the players union now players can actually show their actual interest like wholeheartedly for the WNBA without being penalized or you know what I mean told not to and you know to go to games and stuff like that it's been an ongoing thing for like probably like the last 10 years but like it was like it was really really huge like during covid time because that's when people start realizing well what else is there to watch what else is there to do what else is going on and now that we're out of covid of course and stuff like that people are back outside it's now you know with you know angel reese caitlin clark you know what i mean their stardom from college basketball like i really feel like it start it started with the the fandom of like the the AAU tournaments, the ball is lives and and house of highlights and all of that, like showcasing high school stars, whether they're NBA players, whether they're going to be WNBA players, whether they're going to be overseas players that started that type of content started a ripple effect upwards not downwards like like people are watching eighth graders and sixth graders and stuff like that like come up and, and and go through training but literally watching high school stars started a ripple effect upwards and we all we all know some of the best players in the nba right now in the WNBA are from that like lamello balls and stuff like that like watching kids grow and over time that has made people become fans of oh I don't, I don't watch high school football i mean basketball like that to now watching high school basketball oh i like this player i'm gonna follow them to college oh shit the college basketball is fire connecticut is going crazy you know what i'm saying like it's just like a, a ripple effect upwards and now people are watching the wnba crazy people watching the nba crazy but they've watched these kids become grown men and women and that's really really dope so you know what I'm saying all-star edition cover is fire to me. You know what I'm saying? To me, that's that's the best cover because it it is it's it's two for one. You know what I'm saying? Um this is Jason Tatum's cover for 2K25. Um I will say 2K, this is the first time that they've really went realism with the with the crowd in the back and stuff like that. Like in a in a in a in a long time, usually you're looking at a centerfold of an individual, whether this person is drawn art style wise and stuff like that. Really, it just looks like they grabbed this photo from someone that was sitting on the floor, um, probably from, I would say, sideline or something like that, and took a zoom in um, shot of Tatum with the crowd in the back, blurred him out, cut him out put some vignette around it and called it a day. They, they keeping it super simple. They probably saved a shit ton of money on this, not having to reach out to an individual to draw up the art covers and stuff like that from scratch. So, you know what I'm saying? Maybe the money is out being allocated somewhere else. You know what I'm saying? By keeping it this simple. Um, we going to go over the Jason Tatum screenshots and all that. We just going over the covers right now. Um, this is uh, Ajel's uh, cover. This joint is fire. Want that chip? What what else do you want for her? She got that chip. 
Got the WMVP, you know what I'm saying? Like, just saying, like, come on, man. Come on, man. It don't get it don't get no better than this. As a as a cover, right? Like, you have to understand, people again play 2K, they play all different types of video games growing up. Now she on the cover of that motherfucker. Not only is she on the cover of that motherfucker, she on that motherfucker trophy. Ooh. That this cover right here is gonna be on so many people's walls that love her, love their her team, but not only that, it's gonna be on her wall. Because that motherfucker probably gonna be what? I'm trying to think of a dimension. Sixty six six hundred and sixty eight by six hundred and ninety or something. Who knows? I'm just I'm just making up shit at this point. Um this this cover right here is crazy. I ain't gonna lie, man. Come on, man. Now this this Hall of Fame edition cover, not too artsy, but it is artsy. But what I did notice is this one has grain and smooth gold behind it as well. Now I do love again that bokeh crowd. You know what I'm saying? That bokeh crowd is fight. This is this is where we need to be as far as like iterations of covers like i don't think this cover would have been more fire if he had toronto's raptors colorways in the background or a white silhouette behind them dunking and i feel like this cover is fire enough as well as with the bulk of the background he grained out the logo and stuff like that and grained out um vents except for the gold portion of them like that grain is pretty cool it gives a different feel to it it doesn't feel like the other covers, you know what I'm saying? It feels a little bit different. Um, now let's go ahead and look at screenshots. Like I told y'all, the screenshots on the website, they looked okay, but obviously, if I open this up in browser, like come on, like come on, man. You can you can really get you can really get into the you can really get into the graphics. You know what I'm saying? Like if you let me see, let me see if I can find Jason Tatum's joint. Like, look how fuzzy that look, chat. Like I went to the Discord and clicked on the joint. Like, see, like, see this right here. You can download the 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 4K joint, but the image of it on that on a 2K website is not as good. It doesn't reflect how good the graphics actually look. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, cool, cool little vibes. Let's go, let's go back. You know what I'm saying? Let me see. Um, I want to see if I should open this one up in browser. Now, I don't want to open this one up in browser, but what you do notice is do you notice how her jersey is turned like in in inside like on some like she just grabbed her jersey real quick and like turned that joint like i don't know if i don't know if that was on purpose from 2k to showcase like jersey physics or whatever the case may be like does the jersey change if she fluffed that motherfucker out or, or whatever like i don't know if this is like one of those like what do they call them? Those Easter eggs or whatever the case may be. I don't know if, if 2K is aiming for that, but that's cool vibes, cool vibes. Um, Vince Carter. Now, I'm not going to lie to y'all. This screenshot, it's not the one. I would have loved a, a screenshot of him like after dunk celebrating or or something like that or after shot celebrating or you know what i'm saying like this this meme uh, <laughs> like i don't know man like this this look like vince like in his last day of the league type shit you know what i'm saying like not not young young vince you know what i'm saying like young vince look completely different you know what i'm saying like like we had we have the image here like you know what i'm saying this is what this is what young vince look like you know what I'm saying? This 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 screenshot right here with him on the rap is this is not a young Vince. Now, what I will say is if 2K since the, since this is the Hall of Fame edition cover athlete, they got to somehow like make Vince throughout the years type shit. You know what I'm saying? They should make four iterations at least of Vince Carter, whether it's him on the Raptors, it's him on the Nets, it's him on Atlanta, like you know what I'm saying like you got to you got to make different iterations of vince not just one vince that scales the test of time of his career like you gotta you gotta make him make a young vince you know what i'm saying that that'd be that'd be dope just like how you made froby and all that like make a young vince you know what i'm saying make 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 a vince that you know is, can, can look a little dope because th this <laughs> this vince in his raptors jersey but that boy that boy that boy look 40 <laughs> that boy look 40 i ain't gonna lie 
um all right we do have uh, a couple more uh images and then this video can be done i know i've kept y'all here for a minute but uh let's go here um let's open this up in browser all right women yama okay um i had to get that one off my bad so this is uh wimby and 2k25 big armpits um yeah i mean it looked like it's just i do notice in these images motion blur and bokeh play a huge part i know they still got the sweat and all that going on but it looked like bokeh and and this motion blur effect that they have in video games coming out i'll be feeling like motion blur is a little bit too much on video games i feel like they try to take away from like us really wanting real graphical real look like live you know what i mean like like make these players come to life like don't don't put this motion blur on them to keep them you know what i'm saying looking all wavy and, and ooey gooey like nah bro i want hard crisp graphics every time every single time that's what i want hard crisp grass graphics bro um all right so obviously more sweat um jersey stitching the stitching is the stitching is stitching you know saying look at the stitching you know what I'm saying? I, yo, I remember I remember I made a, a video about the stitching last year and y'all try to get on me. Y'all know that stitching good. I know that motherfucker stitching good. You know what I'm saying? But uh Alexander, uh cool, cool little vibe. It's it's only a it's only a chest up shot, but it's cool. Like I said, Boca. Um that I do like the lighting on this one, you know what I'm saying? But again, that motion blur effect, like it takes away from really like oh shit nah this shit look real real you know what i'm saying like it still it still do look video gameish but you know what i'm saying you know to and, and, and i'm gonna be honest to some people that actually like don't play video games if you if you are literally letting the cpu play you know what i'm saying and you have it on broadcast you like just just because like you just had your controller down at the main menu like when old heads be coming in the crib they be like damn i ain't know they's playing today it do be looking that damn good, but you know what I'm saying these screenshots a little bulked up. All right, so I appreciate y'all for watching. Thank y'all for coming through to, for the news. Um, I'm gonna plug my channels real quick. Um, if you made it to the end, you know what I'm saying appreciate you. Uh, I got a vlog channel link in the description. Um, I'm about to drop my water fast video on that channel in the next two days. Um, I also have a new reaction channel for non gaming content. So make sure that y'all uh, go to my game, my uh, reaction channel as well. The first one is I'm um, just iPod and the other one is iPod reacts. The links will be in the description and in the comment section, but I appreciate y'all content would not stop on this channel. This is gaming. This is my life. So I'm just trying to balance everything that I do because when I'm live on Twitch, we be doing reactions. So, you know, follow me on Twitch as well. Uh, we be doing reactions. we be talking about shit. I be putting up reels on IG and all that. So I'm just trying to figure out like doing all of this content myself trying to figure out like what my schedule is going to be like so make sure y'all sub up to the channels turn on noties and you know what i'm saying yeah that's it i appreciate y'all and i'm gonna see you on the next one peace Game Call.